Leicestershire police constable has been arrested on suspicion of being unfit to drive through drink or drugs after a police chase ended with a suspect who was being chased, crashing his vehicle into a tree and dying. Shortly before 4am on Friday the 25th of November, the Leicestershire police constable attempted to stop a black BMW, but the driver refused to stop. A pursuit was authorised by senior officers, but a short time later the BMW left the road and hit a tree. The 20-year-old driver was pronounced dead at the scene, whilst the passenger was taken to hospital and later released. Any police incident where somebody dies in or following contact with police must be referred to Professional Standards Department and the IOPC. As part of the initial investigation the incident, uh, into the incident, the police driver, who's not been named yet, was required to take a breathalyzer and a roadside drugs test. He was subsequently arrested under suspicion of driving whilst unfit, unfit through drink or drugs. He has been released from custody whilst blood tests are carried out and I presume he has been suspended. Detective Inspector Steve Kilsby from the Force's Serious Collision Investigation Unit said the investigation is in its early stages and will be continuing throughout the evening. I would ask anyone with dash cam footage who saw the collision occur or saw the black BMW beforehand to get in touch. Any details you're able to provide could help. Now, I said only in a recent report that it would save a lot of this if police, before they even got in a police car, take a breathalyzer and drugs wipe. The start of every shift, not only will this keep the public safer, but it will help prevent plod bothering to drink or get high, or it will catch them out before they do kill somebody. I mean, it's not hard and it's far less expensive than paying out compensation for killing someone. I'll keep an eye out for further information on this and I'll bring that to you when I can.